Hi guys, so nice to see you all amongst us together once again. So, hello everyone and welcome. My name is Sachan and today we are going to be playing the Pony Factory. This seems like a pretty strange, really horroristic, dark, atmospheric game. I And that's all I can say about it. I honestly don't know anything else. So, let's just jump right into it. Oh, there's so many settings. There's so many settings given how simple the game actually looks. Okay, well, let's begin the game. Winston arrived at a solution to the moral decay of his town. He called out to Hal in a secret candlelit room one evening, and Hal answered him. The human body could, the human body could, Hal promised, be twisted, twisted, stretched, and broken into a kinder, more equine shape. The human heart molded into something less human. Winston's town, now filled with the cruel and ignorant, could instead be filled with magic ponies. Is this my little pony, guys? Is this like some kind of dog? So the... Rainbow Factory? I don't know. Winston thought they could be beautiful, gentle and good. Hell had other plans. Okay, that's a very dark prologue, guys. Ooh, that's pretty cool visuals, alright. Pretty high, highly graphic. High, high quality graphics, I mean. So, guys, expect highly scary. Oh, this reminds me of Vanish. Oh, that's a game Markiplier has quite wished he could vanish from. <laughs> so, so, what is, what can, what can, oh, we have bullets. So technically we can find weapons in this game. That's pretty interesting. Okay. Well, I think we have to go down. Is there anything? So, okay, so with shift I actually walk normally. So running is the normal speed here and you can slow down. I don't think I want to do that. I'm gonna keep running, I think. Especially when I start to be chased by magic ponies, which are not very magic after all. I don't know. We shall see what happens. So, ooh. I thought these are some dumbbells for like doing some exercise, some curls, you know, maybe we have some tough buff ponies, ooh, okay, so 40 ammo, let's not waste that, I won't even test how it shoots, the maximalist V4 automatic bolt gun, ABG V4, traditionally, livestock is dispatched one at a time, at close range, but our studies have found that this method is inefficient for the rapid harvesting of horse parts, and for the mass production of logical ponies, a fast and more reliable method is needed. To this end, we have developed the, ma the Maximalist V4 Automatic Bolt Gun, or ABG V4, boasting the accuracy and fire rate of a military assault rifle, a 14 round capacity, an ergonomic magazine designed for quick reloading, this tool makes it easy to kill, load, and incapacitate multiple enemies in rapid succession from any range. So any range, okay, we don't have to be close, that's good at least. Uh oh. Oh, I can't. That's wonderful. I thought this is the way back. Okay, let's just approach the sounds of uh, tormented souls from the depths of hell. That should be a good plan, right? Hi, anything here? Is this is this the pony factory, by the way? Are we like a detective sent to? Dispatch to take care of the the wild ponies, the wild equine creatures. So what do I do? Because none of these doors work, guys. As far as I can tell, at least. Review your timetable at the end of each Friday. Change. Moral examination. Scene reading of uh, 0.07 or higher will not be permitted to enter until they become more ch more chest. More cased. Cast? Chest? I don't know. Cased? Failing in multiple examinations may be grounds for termination. Employees are also required to remain virtuous in our site through the week. The work week. The interior ambient scene level may not exceed 7% of the facility's total motor fiber. Hmm. Management will be making every effort to insulate this facility from the outside hedonism. What the hell? 
and exterior scene levels are expected to drop as more of the population are changed into magical ponies. This is... Uh, okay, that's terrifying, guys. It's pretty terrifying. So they want to make the world better by turning everyone into magical ponies. But if they use magic instead and not cruel human ma man-made machinery and forcefulness, maybe they would not have turned out so evil and dark, you know? Just a hunch. You can't force anything to any onto anyone, because it will never result in the results which you which you're hoping for. So what's going on here? Oh, there's another way here. Okay, guys, now I understand. Okay. <sighs> yep, and pretty basic controls. Oh. That's nice. Okay, that's okay. We might have wasted a ton of ammo there. Oh, no, 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 no. Yo, these things can take a lot of damage before they die. They, um... Okay, so that's how they look like. I think that was a unicorn, guys. A unicorn pony. A unicornish. A unicornish. A unicorn pony. So, let's continue up the stairs. Uh, it's very dark, by the way. I wish I could see more. Hello? Okay. We have identified a number of minor leaks into liquid lightning holding tanks. Liquid lightning is the main catalyst in the process of whims whimsical flaying. While management assures us that lightning cannot travel through the air, physical contact with any visible pools of lightning on the ground could expose it to dangerous levels of energy called skin peeling whimsy. Please use the utmost care when moving through affected areas until the maintenance staff are able to fashion a mob capable of absorbing electricity. Oh, sorry. So don't touch these, right? Even if I did not read all of that, I think I would have had the common sense to not touch these. Uh, they don't look very pleasant. For my little totsies, fitsies, you know, I don't think I would want to step in any of these things. Okay, oh, more ammo, that's always nice. Oh, that's terrifying, I can, I can barely see anything. Oh god. Pick up medkits to regain lost health. Hmm. Okay, but I haven't lo Come on now! That's unfair. I literally just walked in f in front of myself and apparently that was a freaking... Apparently that was a freaking uh, death trap. That was a drop into nothingness. Wonderful. Okay, at least we haven't made too much progress, guys. And that's gonna be the only death I tolerate, guys. Okay, no more dying. I'm gonna be trying to make at least this game deathless. All the other games we tried where you can die, like, still wakes the deep. And uh, add the ring eventually, guys. Be on the lookout for that video. I actually have tried Elden Ring and we are gonna be playing through it. Uh, I have not done a single no death run yet. In any of these games. Pick up medkits. Please use caution and respect when circum circumnavigating the precarious death pit. Death pit! Oh yeah! Thank you so much for telling me after I've already fallen in the precarious death pit! I have experienced that wonderful, wonderful place. I don't want to do it again. If your sins also become so great and so numerous as to evoke the birth of God, the precarious dead pit can be jumped into. I'm sure you can free to escape. I don't want to do that. Oh my god! Okay, that scared the hell out of me. Very well placed pony. Well done, guys. Really terrifying. Okay. Anything here? Yep. Absolutely. Okay. Uh, so all, are, are all of the ponies the same? Because they look the same. I wonder if that's the case. Okay, not this way. Ammo. Hmm. We are wasting so much ammo, guys. These are worth like 40 each and I use them up and I only need like 10 or 15. There's an ammo there. We don't need it right now, so we won't risk it. Ooh. 
Oh, that's not. Oh, hi. Yeah, attack them first, guys, before they have the chance to do the same with you. Okay, alright. Yeah, of course. I I mean, that would be the logical thing to do, right? So why is there bloody splats on this door? Okay, let's just enter. No questioning here. Let's just go straight into it. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Any HP? Thing? Oh, nice, nice. Oh, no, 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 no. Why are they hitting you with their hoops, by the way? Why don't they, like, try to impale you with their horns? That seems like a more efficient weapon to me. I guess if they were human ones, then they have the instinct of using... Oh, my God. I guess they have the instinct of, like, using their arms and, like, legs and their feet to attack. And not other weapons, which they now, unfortunately, possess. See, we can rationalize it all we want, but this is really one one messed up place, you know? And that's for sure. Oh! Two of them, two of them, two of them, two of them! Oh, no, 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 no! Yeah, we forgot to reload, guys. Let's not forget to reload, it's pretty important. When you have a gun, which you actually used. Okay, let's go back that way. I think we left something. Okay, I wonder which door is the right one. This one? Okay, not this one. Okay, that's good because I wouldn't... I would have hated to waste the place. My fellow creators, I will try to answer the many questions I have received as quickly and truly, 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 truly as possible. But I'm sure you will understand that I am merely human and addressing all of your concerns will take time. That said, regarding dress code employees, and a reminder that no religious iconography of any kind may be worn in the workplace, as the management is hell itself. Such displays go against our formal to company values. Okay, so this is essentially hell. We work for Satan, apparently, in this game. Or, or like, not us, I think we are like one rogue, em one rogue employee, like us, the player, in this case, who decided to that he had enough of this place, and he is trying to tear it up and destroy it and expose them. That's my theory at least, but that's just a theory. A game theory. We'll see what, if that's actually the case. So what's going on this way? Nothing bad. Nothing good either, but nothing... Huh? Listen, I don't care how you do it. Shoot them, stomp on them, hit them with a big stick, I don't care. If you see a squirrel in here, it dies. No exceptions, I don't know how they're getting in and I don't know how in the name of hell itself they are so organized, but they are damn organized and they seem to be targeting our machines and infrastructure specifically. I am well aware of how insane this sounds, but the squirrels want to destroy this facility before we are even finished, if we've even finished a single pony. Stop them! Okay, we're back. And I'm up here now. So. Oh no 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 That's a big boy and that's a magical one. Oh these are on two These are on two legs that's terrifying seeing ponies on two legs like humans is pretty strange Except if you're Lyra Heartstrings for My Little Pony. Yes, guys, I'm a man of culture. I do know some My Little Pony lore and fanfiction stuff. And fan stuff and uh, actual canon series story stuff. It's a pretty cool series. It's a pretty cool series. It seems girly and not manly. But it's. I have you guys know it's actually a pretty cool series and anyone can enjoy it. Just a fun fact. But this is not... Oh, no! Okay, so these are like unicorns, because they use magic, right? But all of them have...
And they always hit me. They don't miss, which is not good. You can't dodge them, it seems. Brandon, I know this job can get repetitive, and when you get bored, you make mistakes. So remember the 4 plus 1, 4 zero trick. Four hooves and one school go to the pony maker, where they will be grafted onto a fully prepped sinner by way of Hell's Pony Magic. Then four hooves go to the glue maker, where they will be processed into pungent glue, the fumes of which are pumped throughout the facility to encourage Aaron to remain in the proper headspace. And the remaining school gets thrown into the incinerator. Got all that? Four hooves and a school in the pony maker, four more hooves in the glue maker, one school to the incinerator. It's as easy as drinking to forget. Wow, okay. Yeah, this place is really dark in any, in every way. So four, four hooves in the glue maker, four hooves and a school in the pony maker, and the one school in the incinerator. Okay. Okay. In, if you ever need to do that, we'll remember, guys. It's very important, right? Uh, it's just one of those like you know old classic life life wisdom which you need to learn. It never hurts to have this information. Especially if you're an employee here, because if you don't have it, you will be hurt, from what I see. Okay, uh, let's continue up these wonderfully crafted stairs. This place is actually pretty high quality. Well, for what it is, at least. It may not be too well maintained. My fellow creators, just a moment, we finished. This ingenious hoofar weapon of war, adapted from sketches by the great inventor Frederick Flintstone, will allow multiple ponies to chase down wayward sinners from within the protection of a great pony head. And to hurl magic projectiles if the situation should call for it, it will be great. Please refer to the new post schedules for new shift assignment. Winston the CEO. So Winston is a huge, big, big, dumb a-hole. Asshole. He is the CEO of this place. So we have to hunt him down, right? Avoid projectile damage. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. So that's how you avoid the magic orb ones. Nice, nice. Ah, oh, I see. Uh. Oh, hi! Ow. You came up to me. You, you guys... You guys don't know too much about personal space, do you? Maybe you should pick that up. Now that you guys know all of these magical... Bomb throwing abilities, maybe you should learn some other- Oh no! That's another phone is- Where are you? There you are. There you are. Come on. Oh, oh, almost good. Come on, die! Nice, okay. Whew! Not too bad, not too shabby, guys. If I do- Oh, I almost died. Uh, Maybe don't do that next time. Maybe think before I put my foot in front of the other. <sighs> okay, guys, I'm back now. Uh, I had a two-day skip because I had to go to the gym and then all, all kinds of stuff happened and I could not record. So I apologize for that. And I op apologize also for my lack of shirt. I uh, It's almost 40 degrees Celsius, guys. Like I'm sorry, I, I just can't be wearing anything right now. It's I'm, I'm going to be dying, guys. 40 degrees Celsius is, is- Oh! Okay, I'm gonna be displaying it here somewhere on the screen How much that is in Fahrenheit, alright? Just so you guys know, my fellow American watchers uh, Just so they know how hot it is in here and why I can't be bothered wearing a shirt right now Okay, so now that I have explained that, let's get back to the pony factory, boys Boys and girls Okay, so we are killing ponies, yep just a normal everyday activity. Nothing, nothing too strange. Um, so what is actually the idea? Oh, like, do I just kill all of the ponies in here because like they are like an experiment gone wrong or something? Or is there some bigger purpose that needs to be done here? Maybe I have to expose the people who've done this. You know? Maybe I have to expose the people who've done something like this. You know? Oh. Where are you? There you are, okay. I don't know how I dodged that. But somehow we have. Okay, so let me just go back for a little bit of a ammo here, which I left. Some ammo here and some hair packs there. Where's the hair packs? It's here, okay. Oh, it's here, there we go. Alright, I knew I saw it somewhere. Okie dokie. 
All right, come here, my little ponies. I'm not gonna bite you. I'm only gonna shoot you. So you don't have to worry about any bite marks which may appear on your body upon my encounter with you, okay? So that's so that's always a plus. Nothing here. And I have a feeling I'm gonna have a bunch of ponies attack me from in here. Just a feeling. Okay, nothing yet. Okay, that's a bit too deep for me. Let's just go back and find some stuff. Maybe we missed something here. There's a lot to miss. Uh, if only we could have a bit more ammo, because we are leaving so much behind. Okay, that's okay. Okay, we are packed. We are full HP. We are full ammo. We can go down to the depths of hell. Maybe I was a little bit overzealous with my with my confidence there. And perhaps that is not for the best interest of my heart. Um, I, can I crouch? I can't crouch. Okay. Hi. I saw that. Oh, that's... What is that? Oh, that's just some some paper, some lore, guys. We like some good lore. I always I always love to see how much uh, love and effort the developers put into these games. It fills my heart with joy, Mark. I have received your concerns. Concerns, as you know, there's an Im immense amount of excess sin extracted during our processing, and all that sin needs to go somewhere. To that end, a specialized pipeline carries the sin from this facility out into the forest, where it harmlessly per uh, uh, persolates into the groundwater supply. I understand from your report that the sin levels in this same forest recently spiked for a no dis discern discernible reason, but management assures me that the spike is most likely a natural phenomenon and is certainly unrelated to our waste sin pipeline. I agree with this and will further and add that my un a strange son's company is currently performing an extended observation and spiritual analysis of the forest which could certainly be causing also untold sorts of depraved abnormalities. I am confident in our mission and leadership and I don't believe this event in any is any cause for alarm. Thank you for remaining diligent in your work. Winston. That freaking asshole Winston, I don't like that guy. <coughs> His son's brainwashed himself, so now he wants to brainwash everyone else around him. Never a good thing guys. Hello? Did I come? What is this place? Oh my god! That's a big one! That's a big one! That's a big one! That's a big one, okay. At least we get a bunch of ammo. Oh. Okay, that's cool, we got some attachments. The Maximist Enhanced Fire Rate Model Rule. Um. <laughs> okay, wonderful. So we have a better gun now, essentially. It's more gonna it's gonna be more efficient. So is that all which is back here or because I could have sworn there was something else, guys. You know? There was something else in this in this direction. And I would like to check that out, if you don't mind. Maybe I was incorrect. Okay, so I cannot go down there. This is where we came from. Okay, that means that that is indeed the only way we can go. Yeah, so I, I, I thought you could go in this door. But apparently you cannot, so... Never mind me. Sajhan just being saji saji. Let's continue, and if, I, if if you see any more of those huge mother yuckers, I'm gonna be a little bit upset, because that was actually, like, much more threatening than the small ponies. Or like the medium, normal size ones, at least. I, I, I wouldn't call them- oh! oh! Oh, oh, I see now. That's powerful, okay. But yeah, I, I wouldn't call the other ones small, you know, those guys can still cause a lot of damage. And that is not a good thing, not a good thing at all. Why does this look like a boss room? Why does this look like a place where I'm gonna be fighting a boss monster? I don't like that fact at all. It is way too uncanny and way too big for this to just be here for any reason. Hello? Hello? Okay. Okay, so so far nothing out of the ordinary. 
Which is strange, because this is this is an this is very much a boss fight room. A red light. Not a good sign. Oh my god. The red light just makes it more terrifying. Uh, what happened in here? There's some femur bones scattered all over the place. For whatever reason. Okay, I'm slowly running out of ammo, guys, by the way, so... I, I would really appreciate some about right now. Okay, maybe don't touch that. Maybe don't touch that. Over the coming week, we'll be installing the magic friendship energy, energy from hell inside the poem maker. This marks the final step in the pre-production, after which we will use the pony maker to activate all prepared magic <gasps> ponies and swing it into full production. And this energy em as this energy emanates from the depths of hell itself, it casts in shades of light never before seen in this dimension. If you see hues and luminosity hitherto unglimpsed by the sight of mortal man, this could signal a critical leak and should be immediately reported to your supervisor. Sounds good. Oh my god. Are you guys gonna suddenly awaken and try to kill me? I think you seek is at the heart of the pony. Oh, this is this the pony maker? I think that's the pony maker, guys. I think we arrived. Can I get some ammo before I enter there? Can I, you know, can I? Okay, so this is not alive. Thank goodness. But can I get some ammo, guys? Uh, it seems the answer to, th answer to that is a nope, you can't. Okay. What have I done? The ponies, they have all gone mad. This is not magical friendship energy from the depths of hell itself at all. It is pure sin. From the depths of hell itself, twisted to resemble wonder and whimsy. How could hell betray us like this? Oh no, they are coming! Oh no, no! Oh! Okay, at least Winston got what was coming to him, I think. Is this what I was searching for? What is this, exactly? I got teleported somewhere, okay! So, I was searching for a teleporter. You have what you have come for, now escape. Okay, guys, so apparently that's what we needed, and now we have to escape. We are about now. We have to expose to the world what these terrible, terrible people are doing here. But for that, we have to escape alive. You know that's the issue here, and that's a big issue because I don't think the ponies want us to escape. You know. You leave me alone. You sucker, sucker. Give me that. Nice. So, uh, can I go this way now? Nope, I can't. Oh, that's wonderful. I hope we get an HP pack soon. Oh! Kill them! Kill them! Kill them all! Oh. Ooh. Oh, kill them! Kill them all! Ah, oh no! Kill them all, 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 guys, we need an HP pack, badly, very badly, actually, oh no, oh my god, okay, we almost got hit again, and we can't afford too much more hits, guys, we have 35 HP, come on, let's do at least this game with no deaths, come on now, come on, guys, let's do a deathless run, we like deathless, right, oh my god, There we go. Okay, I really don't want to die. That would be really nice to avoid. Let's get out of here, come on now! You are in my way! Oh no. You guys are all in my way! That's a lot of you! Oh god. That's a lot of ponies! That's a lot of ponies. 
That's a lot of ponies. Okay, any... Okay, this game is actually pretty hard when you, when when they don't give us constant health health packs and restorations, you know? If I have known that I come back the same way, I would not have taken all of those things unnecessarily. I would have left some for myself for times like these, you know? Oh, there we go. I'm glad I glad I'm glad I left this one here. I'm glad I left this one here too. Did I? Or have these respond? I don't know if I left two of them in here. I that's my I'm I'm not that generous, you know? But maybe I have. You are not gonna jump scare me today. You are not going to creep me out. Come on, guys. You sucker. Trying to kill me and stuff. Alright, so so who is this Winston? Who is the Vin who is Winston the CEO? Like what what's the point of the funny maker? Because I don't really understand so far, like, why? Oh! Like, do, what, what do they profit off of this? Like, is there some kind of profit, which I don't see? Or, like, what is the point of them doing all of these horrible things, you know? Because I really don't see why. That's a lot of effort to go through. For, you know, hardly any returns. Oh! Okay, at least we do a lot of damage now. So they don't have time to hit us twice. <sighs> okay guys, there's some health packs there. Fortunately, there's a lot to spare. I only need one of them. Okay, now I need more of them one. Wonderful. Now I need two of them to be exact. And I happen to have two right here. Oh my god, stop it! Uh -oh. You stop moving around so I can kill you. Nice, okay. Okay, now we're... Okay, there we go. I, I was gonna say, now we're low on ammo instead of HP. We can flow in HP too. We're still only 85%, not 100%, which is never good. Okay, let's take this. And let's continue back. No matter way. So, so what is this Winston doing? What is his purpose behind this? Because, again, that's a shit ton of work to go through. Unless he has, like, some kind of strange, like, personal vendetta. To try and bring the ponies to life for some reason, and making from like, like turning humans into these magical quote-unquote ponies, they're not very magical at all. They're pure nightmare fuel. Oh god, I'm running out of ammo. There we go. <sighs> okay, alrighty, alrighty now. Okay, I think we are fine. The, ga the game is very generous with the amount of supplies it gives. Fortunately for us. Ooh, okay. Hi. Hi. Ow, you hit me. You're not gonna hit me. Not you. Your friend hit me, but not you, okay? Let's just keep it keep it at that. Okay, guys. We haven't been killed by ponies yet. Mm, is there some HP packs here? Nope, there are not. Okay, yep. We have read all of that. We have been here before. We are just coming the other way now. So that shouldn't come as a surprise. Ooh, nice. Some health pack. Give me that. Hello? Hello? Uh oh. There you go. Anyone else? Hello? You're acting very creepily, not showing up before you show up, you know? You know what I mean? You know, like not giving an indication that you're about to be there. Okay, another one of these dead traps. I don't want to experience what happens if you fall or like walk into that one of those things. So no thank you. No thank you at all. Okay, so what's going on? Ooh, nope, you are not gonna do that. This is the death trap which we fell into. It's actually not- oh, okay, it is very deep. I was gonna say it's not that deep, but nope, it's actually an infinite depth of hell. Okay. 
I think we can actually do this, guys. We got constant HP. Oh, please don't speak too soon. Actually, I can't do that less because I already died in that freaking pit. There, so. But we can do like a no death by actual monsters. Only dead by our own stupidity, which is, you know, pretty good. Oh, we only have six. Oh, there we go. I was gonna say, we only have six ammo. We can't get through this part without six. With six ammo. Can I, can I just jump from there to here? I can. Hey, guys, shortcut. Shortcut. The. Oh, the road has been cut short. Oh, that's so fast. Okay, that's that's so cool. I think that's the first time I've used the full potential, the full speed of the weapon, guys. Because we I haven't had too many super powerful foes for me to use it all that often. Hello. Let's take that. Oh. Okay. That's nice. Okay, guys, we're almost back at the beginning. Hell, we actually are in the beginning. Hell. <laughs> this is hell, alright? This definitely is so powerful, um, I like it. I like it a lot. Quite a bit. Quite a bit. Quite a bit. It is so great to use. Give me that. Give me anything else I may have left here, which is nothing. So let's go back to the left, and that's the beginning of the game. And I, at the same time, it's gonna be the end of the game, I think. But again, I don't really know too much about this game. Oh, hi there. Nice, nice. Oh, there you are. That's a small one. That's a small one. That's not that dangerous. Oh, that is actually the way to go. Oh, we haven't been here yet. Can we go back? We can't go back. Wonderful. We have 36 ammo to be with the final boss. If it's a final boss. It looks like a final boss. There you are. Hi. Yeah, this is not good, guys. Oh, there we go. See, that's more like it. I love this game. See, I was getting scared for a second, but he's like, nope. Ah, don't worry, my friend. Here you go. Have some weapons, have some armor, have some ammo, and have some HP. Now you're good to go on your way you are. And that's that's lovely when the game does that. I like that. Do I touch this? I don't think I should be messing around and finding out, you know. Okay. So why the huge space? Why is it so tall suddenly? Am I gonna have like some huge, very tall monster pony this time? I have a feeling I will, yes. Because surely they- Oh, yes! Yep! Okay, guys, apparently I was correct. Yeah. The game does not give you all of these things for free. Okay. Hi! Oh, get away, get away, get away! Okay, we have to go back, get back to the other side. Oh, he's coming. He's coming, yep. Let's go back. We have to get to the HP HP packs, guys. Come on. Mercy. Give me that. Ah! You leave me alone. Okay. Come on, guys. HP packs, HP packs. HP packs, come on. Okay, 85. Let's give him a few more rounds of what we think of them, you know? Where, where are there you are! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh, we... Did we kill it? Okay, but... Yeah, that thing was causing some damage, just constant attacks when you were in his range, so it was like a... DPS check, a damage check. Whoever deals more damage in the shorter period of time wins. And fortunately for us, that was us. This time at least. Maybe in an alternative universe, we would have lost that fight. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Did we get out? Do we have the information of the booklet? Do we have the booklet which can expose this whole freaking terrible facility? What, what an entrance, by the way. It's not susp suspicious at all. Wow. Did we escape, guys? Did we escape the pony factory? The man smiled as he walked through the abandoned parking lot away from the pony factory. He'd found and stolen the source of the pony magic and escaped with his life. He's done what others thought impossible. And now he, he would succeed where his father failed. With the power of hell at his fingertips, he would create his own pony army. No, no, that's not the ending I was going for. Far larger and greater. All he needed were victims to transform and the factory in which to do it. Hell had planned all this and it smiled too. 
in anticipation of what was to come. Oh, guys, well, that's not that good of an ending. I thought we had some kind of hero who would, like, stop this terrible place from, you know, causing damage. But apparently, we were just another megalomaniac who was trying to do the exact same thing that these suckers were doing. Wow. Very interesting game, guys. A game by David Szymanski, I think. I don't know if I sing that correctly. I apologize if I don't. But yeah, that was the Pony Factory, guys. Really interesting game, really eerie and dark atmosphere. I like the mechanics, simple, but you, you could work with them. And uh, very not laggy, very smooth, very cool, very sweet, and the story was a bit dark, and I'm sure there's more to find out about it later. So, thank you all so much for watching, and I shall be seeing you in the next video. Bye-bye.